got away from the Braves. <laughs> 2 2. And Flores hits one past the mound, but Tomlinson is there to scoop to Crawford. No play at first. And they get the out on Walker as Duda moves to third. Two out. The only way that could have been turned is if Strickland could have made a play on that ball. Just gets past him. And by the time Tomlinson gets to it, and Walker with the hard slide, you always have to watch to make sure he stays on second base. Now Rene Rivera is coming up with first and third and two out. Bruce Bochy is coming out. Maybe it's and I'm not sure what he intends to do. He doesn't have anybody up in the bullpen. Is it what I was talking about? Did the Walker keep the bag at second base? So he wants to review what you're saying. That's that's my call. So apparently that's what they're going to do. But it certainly looked as though Walker was right in the neighborhood. Yeah, he wasn't going that hard. But let's see. Once he gets past the bag, is his hand say on it, or does he go past the bag? No, nah, he's right there. Come on. Listen, stranger things I mean, have happened with this rule. You could say his hand came off the bag, but yeah, that was after that was after the play was over. But they say that you have to retain the bag. But his hand was on the bag until the play was over. And and the thing that gets me about this <laughs> rule is there is absolutely no attempt at turning a double play. That's right. But the but the the, the rule says retaining the bag. When do you have to retain the bag? Well, not Who for, knows? Not forever. At How do you point, know that? At some point, the play's over, well, and you're allowed to de-retain the bag. <laughs> not forever. You're right. But I mean, I mean, Crawford's already held the ball. The play's over, and he had his hand on the bag, and then he took his hand off the bag. I agree. I'm, I'm in your corner. I'm just saying that at any time, whenever you make new rules, they can be interpreted in any way. Well, it's the the law of unintended consequences, exactly. right? You write a rule, and then you. If you apply it the letter of the rule then you get consequences that you didn't intend which makes the rule look absurd and I'll say this you know the 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 intent of the slide rule at second base is positive if this gets called an interference play then the rule should be abolished well we because this is that would be absurd we've also had some people that have had the slide short and not reach second base and that's been uh, asked to look at because they didn't retain the base they never got to the base. Play under review brought to you by Mazda Driving Matters. I mean, it was never the intent of the rule to call this an interference play. And they do not. Thank goodness. <laughs> 